Start. Learned counsel for the petitioner submits that the plaintiff petitioner is 58 years old lady who had instituted suit for injunction in the year 2005 after having purchased the property by way of registered sale deed in the year 2003 full stop. It is submitted that the plaintiff petitioner had been bona fidely pursuing the matter and there has never been any act on her part, comma, which could even remotely suggest any malafide conduct on her part to delay the disposal of the proceedings full stop. It is submitted that the plaintiff has been bona fidely contesting the matter and the delay occasioned in filing of the written statement to the counterclaim was entirely due to lack of proper advice by the counsel for which plaintiff ought not to have been punished. Full stop. It is further submitted that even otherwise all evidence in connection with due execution of the sale deed had already been placed on record and there was no occasion for either of the parties to file any further evidence on account of acceptance of the written statement full stop. It is submitted that grave injustice would be caused to the plaintiff in case the written statement to the counterclaim is not accepted, comma, as all such evidence led in this regard would not be liable to be considered in the absence of any written statement to the counterclaim, comma, contention, therefore, is that delay in moving of the written statement was wholly bona fide and for any inconvenience caused, comma, the defendant could have been compensated by payment of cost, full stop, para, per contra, comma, learned counsel appearing for the respondent submits that there was absolutely no justification for accepting the written statement to the counterclaim after expiry of eight years and no justifiable cause has been brought on record to accept the written statement to the counterclaim full stop. It is also submitted that the provisions of Order 8 Rule 1 CPC clearly bars entertaining of such belated written statement and therefore, comma, there is no error in the orders passed by the courts below, comma, which may require any interference, full stop, para. Having considered the respective submissions urged by learned counsel for the parties, comma, this court finds that the plaintiff had filed the suit for injunction in respect of the property, comma, which she had purchased by way of registered sale deed dated 29.10.2003 full stop. A counterclaim was filed in February, 2006 challenging the sale deed itself full stop. The court had proceeded to frame issues including the question of validity of the sale deed and whether the defendant was the owner of the suit property full stop. The parties have already led their evidence and a clear stand has been taken by the plaintiff petitioner that they do not intend to bring any additional evidence on record, comma, even if the written statement was to be accepted, full stop. From the materials available on record, this court finds that conduct on part of the plaintiff petitioner was not intended to delay the proceedings nor was she to gain anything on account of non-filing of the written statement to the counterclaim full stop.